about what is happening here, folks. The churches are going to the left, which is dragging society to the left, and it is just a downward spiral. We cannot take back society when we're a divided house. We cannot take back those, those, the command posts of, of our culture when we are divided and we're preaching Marxism in our own churches. Can't be done, people. We have to look at that and be very brave and courageous and call this out. Now, we were going to show a movie tonight, folks, Enemies Within the Church. We spent years putting this together. We raised all sorts of money. We interviewed 100 people, many whistleblowers from churches and seminaries and Bible colleges across this country. Many of them were too scared to put their name to it. They would tell us information but many came on camera, and many of them have suffered greatly for doing that. But they were willing to do it because they wanted to do what was right, not what was popular. So we put it out there, folks, and it's going like crazy. And a year ago, a few months ago, we showed it in this venue. And we were going to show it again tonight. A lot of people came here to see it. It's a great movie. We're very, very proud of it. It lays out the Marxism in the church. It talks about a return to real Christianity. It identifies what is fake Christianity, what's counterfeit Christianity. Every church in the country needs to see this, folks. And we were going to see that here tonight. And we paid money. And we sponsored the event. And a week ago, we were told by the president of this institution we could no longer show it. Not at all. Not at all. This is, a, this is a conference about taking back the culture, about freedom of speech. And we were told we could not show a movie here which is about exactly those things. Because there are people in that movie who might be offended by this. And everybody we named, and we name a lot of names in this movie, folks, we're very, every single one of them, we went to and asked for their comment. Every single one. We don't criticize anybody that we didn't come to first. And not one of them would defend their position. And I saw so I went to the president of this, this, this seminary here today and asked why was this movie not allowed to be shown. And I shook his hand, and I was as polite as I could possibly be. And all I got was, well, we showed it a few months ago. We don't need to show it again. That's it. That was it. And then after that, I parted on a handshake, and after that, we're told we can't show the trailer here now either. So this is what I am saying, folks. We need to be very discerning, and we need to realize there's a crisis in the church, and that is leading to a... This institution for 50 years has stood strong for the truth. This institution will continue to stand strong for the truth. And it is no place to be a guest at a seminary to speak ill of that institution that has opened up its doors for this event. I have no connection with this institution. I'm a pastor in Southwest Florida. But I'm going to tell you something. 
We are brothers in Christ. And when things are wrong, we do call it out. And we will, do, we will show charity to those who stand upon the word of God. And Dr. Mike Spratlin stands upon scripture. Well, so why this is a me? sacred place. So, I thank you for your time. Okay.